All feckin' righty, shitey, lefty, loosey, upsy, downsy, feckin' shitein', bollocks, artists, bollocks, shite, shitein' feck. Of an evening. Oh my word. What's the crack, guys? How are we? Um, It's one of those fucking days, man. It's one of those days where it's just everything is a rush. And uh, we made it, though. We made it. Um, Yeah, yeah. So I twisted my fucking arm. So I got a, I got a package today. Um, food, just food stuff and, you know, sweeties and that kind of crack. Um, I do every, every couple of months I do a little, little, like, what's the word I'm looking for? I do a little delivery thing. Treat myself to a lot of, um, fancy stuff, right? Um, but like, it's, it's cheap as chips, right? So it's, it's grand. So it works out a lot better than going down the fucking road to that fucking absolute bastard of a place. So, long story short... Picked it up, was taking the packaging off, and they fuck, they fucking ruin it with fucking packaging. And I fucking twisted my, my elbow. I didn't realize you could do that. Like, same as if you twist your ankle or your, you know, you go over on your knee and shit like that. I didn't realize you could fucking do that. Like, what the fuck? So, my body's rejected me on num numerous occasions this morning. Um, stubbed my toe, as per usual. That's the usual. Um, nothing major about that one, of course. Uh, is it? Is the music on? It is. Okay, why can't I hear anything? Okay, usually this is more than enough. There's something wrong. I guess I brought it down a wee bit. I must have. There we go. Is that better? Can you hear me all right? Um, Math Plus Games, oh my word, thank you so much. Thank you for all that work you did as well. The manual labor. I'm so sorry to have to make you do the manual labor. Oh my word. Um, thank you so much. You, you, gave, you gave so much. Don't leave a review. Aha, uh -huh, gotcha, gotcha. Not a deal breaker. Okay, no problem. I'll, I'll, let them, I'll let them know about that as well. Thank you so much. Uh, Math Plus Games, the sponsor of The Jam, has given us uh, another ton of codes. Um, so, yeah, uh, the prizes this jam are going to be fucking class, all right? <laughs> They're going to be fucking deadly. You're not going to be knowing what to do with yourselves. Thank you so, so much, Math Plus Games. I really, really appreciate it. And to all of you that have reached out and... Um, Donated prizes and uh, game codes and like loads of stuff, loads and loads and loads of stuff. Um, these are these are fucking awesome, right? But most importantly, guys, why the fuck did you go nuts on the prediction? Why in the fuck did you put twenty six thousand on no? Are you mad? Are you mad now of an infinite? 26,000. You knew I had something coming up this week. You knew. I Last last Tuesday, I fucking said, this time next week, I may or may not be having to get something special done. And a lot of you knew. A lot of you fucking knew that I had this shit going on. How in the fuck did you not fucking well work it out that I needed a fucking shite and Beckin bastard. I feel bad for you. I feel bad for you now. I feel bad for you. I had to get my, my beard trimmed. Just kidding. I didn't, obviously. <laughs> See this part here. This is the fucking most annoying part. See it? Look at it go. Look at all this dandruff. You think that's the green screen fucking around? No, it's not. It's dandruff from my beard. Just kidding. It is actually fluff from the green screen. I don't know why that keeps happening. I'm sweating like a fucking pig as well, right? I dropped a slice of fucking pizza. All right, I put a 15 minute timer up so that I could enjoy my fucking pizza and that it would be really nice and really awesome and I fucking well fucking fumbled one of my slices of fucking pizza and listen, I'm not blaming you Math Plus Games. I'm not fucking blaming you at all, all right? But if I wasn't scrambling around looking for my fucking Excel sheets, I'm kidding, of course. But um, no, I fucking, like, it. my body today has rejected me so much. It's insane. It's insanity of an evening. <laughs> right, let me... Let me figure out what's wrong with the fucking bastard shite music. Why is this so low? Is that is that too low for you now? Probably is. Actually, yeah. We're gonna have to keep fucking with the music all the fucking time, aren't we? Fucking shit. Fuck's sake. Let me just have a look. <clears throat> Loud, not low. Not low at all. What? Okay, right. So I need to get baselines in, right? So if I say, I think it was this. I think this is the normal amount, right? But this needs to go up then. So next song, 
typical we're doing this as the fucking shite of a fucking song fucking comes to a fucking close, bastard. Um, there we go. Okay. So hopefully that's pretty good now, yeah? Yeah, that's great. Yeah, isn't that good? Yeah, that's fine, yeah. Okay, right, so, right, listen. Got some lovely sweeties, but at the same time, twisted me elbow, right? Had the fucking, the lights were fucking freaking out of me as well at the start of the stream. It's no wonder I dropped me pizza. It's no fucking wonder. Typical. So I didn't, I didn't get my shave. I almost shaved today, in fairness. Whatever psychic bond we share. True. Hang on, let me try and fix the fucking green screen as well. That shit annoys me to no end. You have no idea. You know how finicky this fucking thing is? Why? Like, everyone else's seems to be perfectly fine. But no, Jern's is completely fucked. Wonderful. There we go. Now if we switch to the other scene. Look, this is what I usually look like. Yeah. Dark. No grey. Not an ounce of grey on me. Yeah. Fucking shit. And it's so weird. Like, this isn't like it don't look like this. I'm actually I'm actually people keep keep mistaking me for Brad Pitt, actually. Um and Sean Penn. And uh I don't know if Sean Penn is, you know, but um listen. Listen, you dunno. We're gonna we're gonna be doing the Journey Jam day two today, uh of the re the results results excuse me. <clears throat> Results. <laughs> the results of, or sorry, not the results. The results is probably going to be on either Friday or Saturday. I'm still waiting to hear back. Thing is, I might have to get up super early on Friday or Saturday. So I don't want to be doing the fucking award ceremony and then the next fucking morning getting up super early. I want to be able to have a pint with you. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> Same. But um no, today we're gonna be doing Fabricate, Dice Wizardry, Trace Out of the Bittens, Buggy Mess, and Funnest Game. There you go. There you go now, guys. Have an evening. Um I have I have all the, the journal words lit, written down here as well. Results. Yes, true. Um <laughs> I have I have a list of like ideas for the Jern Awards. Listen, you all want to know who's the top scores and you know which which game came first overall and in each category. Alright, that's all well and good. But nobody nobody listen, there is the prestige the prestige comes from the Jern Awards. Alright? Nobody cares about that other shit. Alright? The ratings and the you know what what score and all of that nobody cares about that it's the it's the Jern Choice Awards the People's Jern Choice Awards of the Jern Jam which is the most listen you don't you, listen you can hang on let's go up the tab I tried to troll Kilted today and whoever else was in the chat by triggering an early spam of the chat with the first messages but Kilted right probably went. Huh! Oh, oh, my uh, motion, and then bam, right, and started typing, right. So listen, fair play to you, Kilted. I even waited till eight o'clock to start stream because I, I knew my pizza wasn't going to be ready. But listen, fair play to you. All right, Andy took first. Shark was like a fucking millisecond as well after, which was mad. So it is after I hit the fucking start button, the first message that comes in after that point, because I thought. Kilted would probably write a, a longer message. But listen, wasn't trying to catch anyone out. Wouldn't do that. Fair, fair play to you, Kilted. Good on you, Shark. Shop at the Wordle Town, the feck are you? Um, I see April Dawn, how you doing? Tom, how you doing? I see, um, said that already. Uh, Lynx, how you doing? Tactics was to crack. James, how you doing? Uh, Sigma, good to see ya. Uh, Bus, bus, hello, hey, welcome in, how are ya? With the Bleely Lees, uh, BitGamey, how you doing? Um, Jern Twisted Arm, yeah, true, 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 true. Mass Plus Games again with a Prime Sub, you know what we do when we get a Prime Sub, we're actually diverting them all to John Rosato, the leader of, of the, the Unity group, um, and we're actually, we've made, we've made, um, ones based off the Tick Tank from Command and Conquer, so these particular leprechauns are bred with, with mole hands, all right, and what they do is, as soon as they're born, they get the pheromone from John Rosado's bollock, because he's unkempt in that particular department, and they 
burrow in through the ground and they fucking go all the way across continental no fucking problem to them these ones are these ones are pristine right and they come straight up and they fucking bridge they're fucking mole hands i don't know if you've ever seen mole hands they're terrifying fucking bastards right and they go straight up the bollocks straight up and then they do a starfish with their mole hands very painful listen it happened to him three or four times that's why he's being such an arsehole it's the pain from his bollock um right so <clears throat> desert tiger how the feck are you is it an irish spice bag you know what it's not it's uh, i don't actually like corn right i didn't get it i didn't understand what i was buying i fucking i kind of hate corn all right but i it didn't it didn't click for me the name is mexicorn it didn't click for me that it was actual corn. Okay, so I don't know if I'm going to like these. Honestly, I can almost guarantee that I will not like these. But I did get them. Look, they're they're cool. They're in a cool package. They're very they're very sleek and um chic and um there's fucking a lot of them as well. Um but very cheap. Very cheap. Thought I'd try them out, you know. Not a fan of corn though. Didn't didn't put two and two together on that one. Didn't think to myself, oh Mexican corn, that's probably corn. No, didn't didn't at all. No, completely. <sighs> I was still gonna eat them. Don't think I won't. Fat bastard. Uh, right. So body was rejected me. Many many titans today. Now, yeah, neat and true indeed. Tom, yes indeed. Let's 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 do the German have a shake off. Um, thank you very very much for that. Uh, that is a no today. So enjoy your share, guys. Of the uh, one thousand five hundred twenty. That was quite a lot on yay actually. Did you try to lick the weenus? Not today, I see, but sometimes I do, yeah, just to make sure I'm still in shape. Um, Alice, you know how you doing? Felicity, 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 oh, yes, true, true, Felicity, Felicity, Jern, yeah, that's a person, probably. Um, denied raffle, which, what's, what's tonight? Um, can I get the dropped, the dropped pizza? Five second rule, you didn't want this pizza, guys. It wasn't a real pizza, it's my grill thing that I do. <laughs> you know about that, right? I told you all about that. So what I what I do is I get a I get a I get a flatbread thing. It's like a it's not a pizza base. It's um it's a wrap, um like that you should be like wrapping and then eating. But instead I leave it flat. I put it in a George Fork button, and I put I I cover the fucker in tomato sauce. I get some mozzarella and some some of that other shite, and go fucking ham. And then I put on, I sprinkle on some, uh, what do I put on next? Oh, the, the mini peppers, you know, the small pepper. Listen, there's a process to this. I've, I could fucking sell these things, they're really nice. So I get those little peppers and I chop the fuckers up. And uh, I, I find that's much better, you know, than buying the big ones. Because the big bell peppers, like, you have like two or three days and then they start going black on the inside. It's like, oh, God. Um, but with the small ones, you're always chopping a fresh pepper, technically, kind of. And they're, they're quite nice, they're quite crunchy. So, um, yeah, there's that. Um, what else? I usually put on jalapenos at that point, but I didn't have any jalapenos. Guys, there's a shortage of jalapenos. I don't know. I haven't gone this far or this long without jalapenos in quite a while. Um, then turkey. So I have wafer turkey. Yum. Fucking yum. Really, really nice. The thinner, the better. Um, what else did I put on? Oregano and some spicy shit. Uh, what else? Did I, I put something else on. I can't remember what it was, though. Oh, tomatoes. Baby tomatoes. So I get those little baby tomatoes. I slice the fucker in half and... Whoop, whoop, whoop. I put about fucking ten of them on today. I'm, I think I'm kind of addicted. Um, yeah, I think I'm addicted. You know what? My mom fucking hates tomatoes, so I don't know. I've been asking questions. You know? Tell ya. Uh, right, what are we doing? Music volume is kind of okay. It's very loud. What? Loud but low. No, not low at all. Fuck you in particular. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. What toppings did you have in your pizza? Coke? What? <laughs> I can't, you can't put a you can't put Coca-Cola on a pizza. That would make it all soggy. Um quantum photon entanglement and wavelength purification because the specific atmospheric constraints localized directly behind you. 
Kilted knows. Kilted. Kilted does science. He's a fucking scientist as well, I tell you. Um, are you not an amalgamation? You know what? Probably. If I knew what that word was, it probably would be, yeah, of an evening. Um, Desert Tiger wants inspiration. We only regret the changes. Chances. Ch Hang on, it's upside down. We only, we only regret the chances we did, didn't take. There you go. Desert Tiger, and it's upside down. I'm fucking hip, man. I can read upside down, no problem. Easy, easy claps. How are you doing, Code Rad? Thank you so much for the raid. How are you keeping? What's the crack? How was your stream? What are we up to? Feck. I can try it. Um, Owen, how are you? Good to see you. Reluctant. Yeah, true. Uh, be nice to know I is it Pirate Dorito. Yes, it may well be. Oh, what, what, what the uh, fish you almost got me. What? With the oh, Brits yeah, want to win, join jam in the squits. True, 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 true. Can you see for starting the stream until I'm first to type in the chat? We've done that a few times now, yeah. Yeah, we've done that a few times. Um, yeah. Like an indie game, but so, you can miss yeah, rewards. That's yeah, interesting. True, 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 true. Bars and Oki, how you doing? One, one, lion, how are you? Definitely hated corn until I got blue apron corn. What the fuck is that? Nice Jetson, shark. good to see you. How are you keeping? Twitch dog, how are you? Ocular Battle says it's going. Yeah, um, yeah. It's been so, corn in the name. What do you mean? And it's corn in it. I didn't fucking listen. When you're going shopping online, you don't fucking like. Go, oh, oh, I know what that fucking, what that's about. I just seen Max, I seen the fucking, the chili. I was like, that sounds like something I'd enjoy. Didn't finish. Didn't put two of two together. Listen, popcorn doesn't have this kind of corn in it. So, joke's on you, Kilted. I, I won that argument right there. Yeah, come at, come at me. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Um, super excitement, hot, spicy corn stuff, and leprechauns, true, 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 true. Um, I did not any, have any fucking drinks today. Shut up. Shut up the fuck. Can I not have a bit of fucking energy today? Huh? I've been fucking, fucking going fucking ham all fucking day, and I can't fucking come along and just fucking chill the fuck out, no? Can't fucking just be yourself, Jared. No, you have to be the same fucking boring, fucking low energy shit. Or else you get fucking ostracized. Is that how it is? Huh? Is that how it is? You fucking might have get you with one of these, I tell you. <laughs> corn nuts taste quite different to me than other corn projects. Uh, true, true. Uh, Twitch dog, perhaps. Perhaps to be nice. I don't know yet. Sounds like a pizza to me. True, true. <laughs> I mean the cheesy goodness. Yeah, Sammy, how you doing? Disco, how's it going? Code Rad, thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? What are we up to? Um, you can't germ, but don't have a certain nice time you're reading. Okay, fair enough. Um... He's making a game, there's no crack, true, 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 true. Decided to add object pooling to project as bad idea. Bad idea? Object pooling? What? That was one of the first systems I wrote in Rise of Piracy was the object pool. And the state it's in now, code rad. Not good, not good. Uh, Blue Apron is a meal delivery service. You choose meals for the week, they send you a box. What? Holy shit, one lion. That sounds deadly. Mexico, Mexico, and Roger Turner, Mexico, right now. Hmm. Yes, true, probably. Popcorn is that type of corn. Just heat it up a bit. No, it's not. No, it's not. This is the one. This is the other one. Listen, you're wrong. You're. Shh. Let me Google that. <laughs> Fucker. Um, Johnny Lefty Lucy the entire day. True, true, true. Weenest moment, I guess. True. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Everything is broken. Excellent. Code Rod, that gives you a lot to do. And being busy is good. <laughs> Fuck. I'm running out of steam already, guys. I can't wait to play these fucking games today. We're going to be playing Jern Jam 2 games. Up, down, down, raising smoke. Go <laughs> right, if you have anything at all you want to share with us, throw it in the chat. Let's get fucking started, shall we? Jeez, I have so much shit on my fucking desktop. I've no idea what any of it is. It could all be really bad. There could be a picture of my passport right there. And I wouldn't... I wouldn't have a fucking clue. I'm just that kind of bastard. You know what I mean? Um, right, what are we doing? Here, hang on. Actually, I had loads of fucking really sensitive shit open today. Including, but not limited to, loads of stuff. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, wait. Right, what's the first game we're playing? I mean, welcome in the Raiders first. What is the first game we're playing? Dice Wizardry? Yeah, Dice Wizardry. Okay. Isn't that, that's the, that's the one we're playing first, right? Um, 
That's right, isn't it? Ocular Malice, I think. I think it's Dice Wizardry, and then Trace Elements, and then Buggy Mess, and then the funnest game. And then tomorrow we're doing Fabricate, and... That's what you get. One of them. <laughs> How does your password look? Oh yeah, it's just this one here. <laughs> oh fuck, we're back in this scene again. How did that happen? Right, the first one is Fabricate. It's Playing Browser, right? So I have all of them open, and we're all ready to go. But why is Dice Wizardry coming up first? Maybe we should just do the do that one first of the evening. No, we won't. Look at this, guys. 157 ratings. I noticed a lot of you who took part did not rate yet. You know I'm giving out the prizes, right? You know I have, you know I have the say on who gets what. Do you know you know that, right? Get to the fucking ratings. Make sure that all of you have done your fucking ratings. You don't want to be fucking... Listen here. <laughs> when I get on my fucking bad side. <laughs> it is indeed yours, Zachler Mellis. I'm only fucking with you. Um, it is that kind of evening, yes. How's it going, Brian? Good to see you. Journey, journey time, too. Do you have a fair name? Close this word before you accidentally <laughs> reveal all the codes. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, true. <laughs> we're good. We're good. I rated six games today. Okay, I'm working on it. True. Do, do, do. I rated them all for today. Good. Good. Scary. Yeah, true. It's fucking... It fucking... You don't even see it coming. Honestly, it's crazy. Right. Let's go to Dice Wizardry. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We're just going to keep making that joke. All right. If you want to see this story, you need to skip intro. Otherwise, the last page, rerun the game and skip to see the story. What? If you want to see the tutorial, you need to skip the intro. <laughs> what? <laughs> Tutorial isn't starting. Okay, good. Listen, like I said, if there's no if there's no fucking bugs in your submission, I will suspect you of cheating. Rid of them all. Accent, accent. Good on you. Keep keep it up, guys. Keep it up. The tutorial works if you skip the intro. Okay. How does that? How did you even write that bug in? That seems like a really difficult one to do. Um, to be honest, I wanted to make a game. I'm not concerned about ratings. Links, if you're not if you're not rating the others, then you're kind of outside the spirit of the jam, aren't you? Um, I have no bugs. Yes, true. That's why I didn't see the tutorial. There you go. How you doing, Nerduino? Good to see ya. Best bug ever. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, I might write that down. Mm. Get ready to embark on a pixelated adventure where you, the missionary, the visionary miner, um, start small and dreams big. I've been spending too much time on a certain Discord. Um, right, so I have to hold, I have to skip the intro, or to skip the intro, but I kind of want to see the intro first, you know what I mean? I'm covered the business, ooh, very nice. Expand your empire. Oh my words, I have an empire. Um, right, and then... And then use your earnings once you invest in machinery, strategically placing them to optimize resources, trash them, and maximize profits. Holy shit, this seems really, this seems really, um, you know, fabricate. Fabricate-y. Um, the climax of your mining odyssey awaits with strategic planning and well-managed mine. Activate the mysterious portal machine. Ooh. Portal doodles. Um... I can do a word where every click shapes your destiny. Well, every click, I'm clicking like mad here and nothing's happening. I don't have any destinies because of that. Sure, a buzzbot went on. Well, yep, true, 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 true. Holy fuck, it looks great. Okay, right, so we need to do the tutorial, but we have to skip the intro screen. This is great design altogether. Okay, there we go. Ready to dive into the per per pixelated depths and admiring brilliance. And this is your quick guide to becoming a mining maestro. Next. Uh, meet your new best friend, the extractor machine. This beauty mines diamonds straight from the heart of the pixelated planet. Sparking gems are your ticket to fortune. Oh, I would say move these inside the box if you can. Um, I, I almost clicked the X button here, which I, I'm guessing closes all of them, right? But yeah, move them in, I think. Very nice tutorial so far. Ready for the real dazzle? Take those diamonds to the converter machine to turn them into sweet, sweet cash. Ka ching True. True. Uh, ready for financial glow up? You're starting at zero. 
But get ready because that's time to change big time. Ooh, with extractors turning mine and my diamonds and converters turning them into moolah, you're on the brink of pixelated fortune. And there's going to give to a bit of dollars floating and a bit of a good two. two, two, two. Um, all right, mining maverick, let's grab those dazzling diapons and turn them into pure pixelated gold. Let's walk over to snatch up those sparkling gems right from the extractor shiny right. Oh, I can move. Hang on a minute. I thought it was going to be a point and click game. So we're going to the sparkling gems from the extractor, this guy. Okay. Now drop them into the machine and let the magic of wetlet unfold. That was one buck. Talk about the power of this. Uh, okay. So I want to upgrade my shit. Time to flex those mining muscles. I, I love this game already. Now that you're a pride dollar owner, has <laughs> exclusive walls and expand your mining dominion. Click on the mine wall button to unleash your mining prowess. Can you guys hear the music? It's pretty good. How about that? Is that better? It's a diamond extractor, you just can't see it. <laughs> uh click on the mine wall button to unleash your mining prowess. It's time to make the mine wall button and then clicking on the wall and it disappears. I didn't though. Do I need to? There's more. Those walls and meets the eye. Get ready to discover locked wall tiles that hold the keys to unimaginable wealth. As you mine, keep an eye out for special locked wall tiles like those fellas. Um, these hidden gems hold the secrets to unlocking advanced machines, powerful upgrades, and lucrative boosts. Um, click on the mine wall button. Uh, select a locked wall tile and unveil the treasures within. <laughs> Each unlock brings you closer to mastering the art of pixelated prosperity. Okay. On the verge of something you're starting, keep choosing to out to the space in your mind. Um, yeah, yeah, you're going to need to give me a bit more help. Um, your journey just becomes a bit of a kind of way through. Uh, Dictate for a in your mind and explore every nook and cranny. Who knows when we're valuable to Okay. Uh, as you mind, you will unveil special machines, game changing upgrades, and boosts that will propel your empire to the moment better than have It's kind of cool, though. Like, I, I like it already. Uh, remember your ultimate goal is... So I am reading them, even though it sounds like I'm just making sounds with my face. I'm actually reading all of these very, very fast. Um, so there you go. All right, Mathbots Games, thank you so much again, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. And and to Brian as well. Um, thank you, guys. I have everything I need now. So it makes my, my work here a lot, a lot easier. Um, waiting for an opportunity. Accents. You're dead. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> it's a little wordy. No, it's fine. And uh, the climax in DJS, true. I am going to miss some some chat probably, but that's okay, right? Do the thing. Oh, wait, I can only do the... Aha, you don't have to be standing at it. Okay, give me one of these again. Is this supposed to... Fucking headbutt that bastard. Come on, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> this is class. Oh, my, my mouse is off center. Interesting. It's fine. Doesn't matter. What about these? What did it say about these again? A oh, converter machine. For five bucks. Yoink. Oh, wait. That's, that's one of these, is it? It's just the same. It's the same again. Transforms diamonds into various switches. Expansion of your mining operations. Okay. If they're adjacent to each other, does one go automatically go into the other? Because that would be cool. Let's just keep keep going. Do I have to be closer to it? It costs three to mine now? You never told me that was going to happen. Unlock the other one. Is that my mom? You need to conveyor. Oh, there's conveyors. How come I'm not? Oh, all right, okay. Gimme, 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 gimme. Fucking gimme, 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 gimme. All right, fine. 
Extractor. Sell machine. Okay. What about these? Are these like not mineable? Is that what's going on? For the wall areas to get unlocked. Aha, uh -huh, gotcha. Cool. Man, it's so hard to find things and it's going up in price. Am I cheating? See some people about Google right? Yeah, it's it's huge. I think that's stopping people from rating those games as well. Which is bad. We need to like we need to keep going with the ratings, guys. Some of the games are in desperate need of ratings. And then there's there's bad mindsets as well, like one we, we seen there a wee while ago, isn't there? But I mean you can't force things on people. You can just facilitate them having a bit of fun and hope that they uh Oh, we can open these, okay. Am I playing this badly? I'm playing this badly, right? Yeah. I'm looking forward to getting the converters. <laughs> I mean <laughs> When am I gonna find stuff? Headbutt the fucker. Vera is off to the right and about halfway down. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> off to the right, the halfway down. Even you're getting bored. <laughs> it's your game. <laughs> Hang on a minute. That is shit. Was I cheating there though? Like, see the way it's going? Ding ding. Am I gonna get like nine? How 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 do I know when this is ready for me to take out of it? It doesn't have a visual cue, does it? How are you doing, Duca? Build more extractors and converters. That's actually a good idea. But then I'll have to move. More converters? Why would I need more converters? Will I get full refund now? Is this one going slower? I feel like... Ah, there's supposed to be an icon, gotcha. I feel like this is no faster, Brian. This is no faster. I've been trolled. Oh no, hang on. It is faster, but only just. How come that one was done before the other one? Is there opportune areas to put these in? Find the conveyor, yeah. Okay. Halfway down to the right. I feel like I'm stuck in some level of pegatory. I don't know which one it would be, but yeah. <laughs> Hello, Griffin. Yeah, I'm hooked on this shit already. Oh, oh, we have we have it. I think. If you put them right next to each other, do they not automatically go? That was four. Yeah, this is very cool. Gimme. Yes. Five, okay. Is it working? Can I can I do a, a square like four into one? 
Or is that a bad idea? Wait. Wait. Is it working? It's working, right? Yeah. Okay, so can I... Can I rotate these things? It doesn't look like he can rotate them, right? So it is, it's a one-to-one -one relationship for all of these, yeah? Happy? Oh shit. Can I walk over the conveyors? I can't walk over them? I feel like I'm getting money extremely slowly. Okay, he can sell. So I guess it's okay. <clears throat> Time for coffee. You're not wrong, Duke. We can honestly play the next game whilst we're playing this one. Have you guys ever played, um, there was a game back in the day called Swarm Simulator. Fucking hell. Her tiny legs would break them through. I love the art. The music's good as well. I don't know why that's happening. So I'm guessing, like, very math heavy game, is it? No, I meant to click this one. My mouse was over this one, you fucker. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now you're stuck? No, I'm fine. I can my mouse, right? Right? I can, right? Surely I can. Wait, the ones on the left aren't red anymore. Fun, though, man. Ooh. Yeah, the, the way that this goes up in price every time is, is shit. <laughs> I don't like that. But, I'm guessing there's a good reason behind it. Watch the cost per wall rise with your progress. Right click to seamlessly switch. Alright, okay. Yeah, see I'm not stuck anymore. You're stuck. <laughs> I'm just gonna go up and left with this. So now I'm just waiting, right? Actually, we could go down, we could go down another level, or we could put another group here somewhere. Should we just do another one right here? Ugh, that costs so much. Ugh. Yeah, we should. If we just have a million of these, book it. You'll need a hundred grand for the portal machine. The incremental price. The incremental price is shit. Yeah, I agree. But everything else is flawless. But but what's what's the idea behind that mechanic, Ocular? You must have put that in there for a reason, right? Why why would you um, prevent the players from just going around one tile at a time, one dollar? Per tile. Mm. So people will have to mine more. Okay. Probably give the conveyor, yeah. This is why we jam, yeah, absolutely. It's good feedback, I think. 
Didn't happen after you increased the price. Okay. I'm going to get that playtime up. Yeah. Press T for tutorial. Price, the price increase is killing it for me, man. I'm not gonna lie. Increase max funds, get some speed increases. You can now putting like a hundred a second. Increase max funds, get some speed increases. Increase max funds. I don't get what you mean. So do I need to like reach fifty? <laughs> He's recording it. I need it. I love eating coffee. Same Duke. Same. Need to get speed increases, do I? How do I upgrade these fuckers? Can I put this on top of this? No. So I'll just wait until I get 50 then, yeah? Useful for answer and knocked out, so it'll increase max funds, uh, speed up machines. Gotcha, okay. So I, I just have to go fucking ham with the mining. If this was like five maximum at this point in the game, I think that'd be cool. Like, if I could just go over here and go blah, 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 blah. But I'm wondering... Like, it is a great game. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm not shitting on your game or anything like that. But, um... Oh. Okay, I was wrong. Okay. Let's put in another row, shall we? Use some more balancing? Absolutely. I think it, it could be really, really, really special. Like, it's definitely extremely impressive. I don't know how you manage to... Like, it, it must be very math heavy, is it? Like, how do you work out stuff like this? Like, the adjacency and... It must be like, if the square is occupied by this thing, then the next thing to it is doing something else or whatever. Must be it must be a difficult one to to develop, I'd say. Very impressed. It's definitely one of those games that you can AFK in. The cost increase seems too fast, yeah. How much is this now? 15 per tile. Plans for negative tiles too, like reverse conveyors and stuff, but not enough time. Gotcha. It'd be cool as well if like the conveyors could, like if we had one of these and four of these around it, I suppose you'd, you'd still end up in this kind of scenario because it's probably the most efficient way to do it, right? But yeah, very, very cool. Played a wee bit of Factorio back in the day. It's giving me that. FK, yeah, yeah. Limit the price increase to five. Yeah, yeah. Mining cost increase seems excessive because you don't have down post champ. Yeah, sounds good. I'd honestly be down to come back and play it again. I'm gonna do I'm just gonna listen. <laughs> once we have once we have this these two done, I think we're I think we're good to like expand and branch out. Cause I'd say this is part, very reminiscent of everybody's probably doing the same kind of thing. You know what I mean? Can I run a row of diamond extractors, have the conveyor below them to point into one connect yeah, that'd be cool.
Okay, we're good. We're leaving. 30 groups, my word. Having it at five, maybe making the mine cost max out at 10% of your max funds. That, that sounds good. Yeah, 17 is, is ridiculous price for just for just looking around. So what what is that a problem with? Balancing or is that execution? The idea is brilliant. The mechanics are class. Really, really good. The only problem is the balancing, I think. Because I really do want to, like, explore. Oh, here we go. All right, dopamine. Here we go. It's a lot of waiting. Up to 40 until the tile cost was 101. Oh. Ooh. That doesn't seem to have worked. Maybe maybe the, the the UI event didn't work, but should I should I go a different way now? Or should I keep going? I should keep going, right? Maybe a map or what else could you do? A detector like in um Oh, what's it called? Rimworld? Seems like a bug, gotcha. That must be what Melz was talking about. Pa ching Is there a button for lowering the volume? No. Muting? Maybe if your if your income rate is high, max out the uh, thing at every like, or even even like make it a make it a spatial sense. So the further you get away from this, yeah, that that would be good. I think. Talking to Star, I thought it was a good idea to for a sensor. Yeah, yeah. Even if it's something that you carry around, but yeah. Jeez, I can only do two at a time. Are you serious? Oh, that's a good idea, Tom. Lock detector. Yeah, that'd be cool. Senor John. Do you remember that thing that happened with your third person shooter with your gun floated in front of the player and you were like, isn't there a game where this is the mechanic? Yes. What is the game, one lion? Push. Push is such a great movie. You mean the, the 2015 version of Push? Or the 20, 2015 one? Push was so good. The, uh... The Uzi? And he's like this. And he's like... Bub, bub, bub. I remember that. Is that what I was thinking of, though? Perhaps. I can't remember the game. That I was thinking of for that. We're up to twenty-five. What happens when our when our mine wall becomes greater than the minimum or maximum? Is there any cheats, Ocular Malice, that I can use? Didn't spread the tiles out that much, fuck's sake. It's game over. Okay. A few bugs. But overall, really, really nice game. And, uh, yeah, it would definitely be down to come back once you have all of those things finished or fixed up. Or even, like, I don't know, like, for the purposes of a jam, right? There was a few people who's now put in, like, a jam settings or jam thing, right? Like, the, there was that puzzle game that had it. Um, I think that was yours, Griffin, right? So, like... For the purposes of the jam, you could skip ahead or see more or uh, give yourself some cheats. I think that'd be cool. Old PC shooter where there was an arm graphics with blisters. <laughs> Deadly. A bomb, yeah. Or a tool upgrade that makes you take out three in a row or something like that. 
But yeah, this is this is the gameplay now, you know, and that's not the intention. I'm I'm sure of it. Do you have a video or anything of it so that we can see the rest? Because we're we're about done, I think. Yeah, I'm not sure. One line. It sounds it sounds good though. It might be it might be just my brain being that way, if you know what I mean. Anything to discover in the void or is it just the same tiles? It, there is some more locked locked things. We'll have to make a video. Gotcha. Cool. Well, send it to us during the week and we can watch it at the end, maybe. And uh, go through it again. It's cool. Like, I like... You've you've nailed the, the mechanics. The only, literally, the only problem, I think, is the price increases. I think that I think if mine wall was still one or five, I think we'd be good. Yeah. And uh, a way to mute the the audio because the kachings really do get annoying. Oh, there we go. Let's grab this one first. Are they like they're they all like within five or ten of the of the thing? Let's grab this first. Come on. Also, it seems like if you click on the button, it doesn't work. But if you click on the background, it does work. So maybe take Raycast off this Raycast block. What did that give us, by the way? I didn't see. Very speed pitch, yes. Your funds increased. Oh, shit. We're at maximum 500 now. Okay. Should we keep going? I feel like we kind of should. Yeah, let's make another row of these fucking... Ugh, it's going to cost so much, though. True, true, but bad. Thanks, Riffin. Just go out to left here a wee bit. I don't think I'm arsed. Pitch variation, but didn't... Gotcha. If they were... I think if they were spatial sound, I think it would be better, honestly. So distance to the camera. So if you're like... If you're here, you get an ambient sound and a ka-ching every now and again if you're close to them. I don't know, Griffin. I don't know. Seems like you need some of these. Hmm. Sussy baka. <laughs> you can only hear them if you're close, yeah. And you could, like, play around with the sound a little bit, and, like, the further you are away, the more you hear, like, an ambient rumbling or in a mine kind of sound. Mm-hmm. What are those? Is? What? What if you hit it three times, you can break through without mining? <laughs> now we need we need we need lower lower cost for the mine. But other than that, it's great. Really, really cool. Jesus. Uh, resource mining, start small, extracting, blah 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 blah. blah. Do, 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 do. Acquire new tools. So it was a hundred grand for the portal machine. Yeah, the the art was amazing. Um, the gameplay itself was amazing. The only problem uh, was the the balance, and I think other than that, you had it in the bag. 
Like, we can just tab out. We can come back to it. Let's do that, shall we? We'll just, we'll tab out. We'll play the others, because I think the next, like, two or three games are play out of browser. That was great potential, yeah. Machine speed increase. All of them? That seems pretty fucking sweet. Right, I'm going to tab out. We're going to have a look at the next game, all right? But yeah, great stuff. Great stuff, uh, Ocular Malice. I remember last year as well, I was very impressed with your with your stuff. Like, you, you always go for... You always go for, like, a very... Like, your mechanics and stuff that you come up with are class. And uh, honestly, that was that was really nice. All, all, all other stuff aside, Ocular Malice, I, I'm actually quite impressed by that. <laughs> all right, Dice Wizardry by Tom. Let's get it. Tom, this is you, yeah, that's in the chat the, uh, the last few days. Tom, Tom. Wait, this is a play in browser as well? Nice. Fucking deadly. You get extra extra um, points for that, you know, in the Jern Jam Awards. The Jern, the, the awards for Jern. <laughs> this is it here, yeah. Tom the Fish, here we go. I need to go back, actually, and follow everybody who was in the uh, thing. One second now. Oh my word, but Gaming, that's so funny. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I think that's I think that's like one of the later ones. There was no particular order to choosing when I was gonna play stuff. So your game Yeah, your game is last today, but Kami. If you're if you're leaving or anything like that, let me know. Um we have Satolix and links as well before it. Alright, Tom. That's both browser and download, but we're gonna play it in in browser. But good stuff. Let's let's bring open the other one in tabbed form. So we are actually going to play it at the same time. <laughs> Supposed to save the best until last. True, 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 true. So there's no there's no music. Or did I I I muted this tab, but this one's still open, so there is no music. So uh, W S A D and click. Let's put on our own music if there is none. Oh, there is music. Okay, never mind. Uh, Dice Wizardry, Eyes of Doom. Up, down, left, right, and click. Assemble your dice. Add a pickaxe to the dice. Add a fireball to the dice. Add an axe to the dice. Okay. What did I just choose? The right one on the right? Ability and dice. Insert your ability. Okay. What the fuck? I just know what's happening. What am I doing? <laughs> what am I fucking doing? Choose your doom, okay? What is happening? I'm not I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing or gain a quest. Select ability upgrade out of three. Increase speed of fireballs. Okay, I need to read. Assemble your dice and fort again fight against hordes of eyeballs, upgrades for your choice and choose your doom. Uh, arrow keys to move, mouse to select and buy upgrades. Select and buy upgrades. So am I, am I fighting them? Should I be able to hit them with something? You made your own music as well. And art. Awesome. Yeah, the art looks really nice, the pixel art. And it's made in Godot, okay. Add sword, yeah. Let's get a sword. You have a sword already. I don't get what I'm doing with the dice thing. Do I need to roll? Oh. Oh. Huh. 
I haven't seen any ogres, so we just keep going with that. I'm trying to click on the eyes as well. And what does it mean by dice? They're all one, one, one thing, right? Okay, let me have a look. Uh, your attacks are based on dice rolls. Attacks are automatic, no clicking needed. Uh huh. Dice rolls are automatic. Uh, I don't know why it freezes for a moment when you get hit for the first time in the browser version. Okay. Hello, uh, Marcus. How you doing? Increase maximum ma possible magic missile count. Pickaxe. Add magic missile to a dice. Sure. Ugh. Okay, we got the big guys now. When it says dice, is it only firing something when it hits one? Upgrade sacks, yeah, whatever. Sure. What? Huh. Sure. So this this is like the dice roll here. Add a new number dice to you an ability dice. Huh. Spawn random resources. Am I supposed to be collecting these? I feel like I, I should be, but I'm not. I, I collected the tree though earlier, right? Oh, jeez. Okay. How you doing, Marcus? Gain a new ability dice. It's probably good to do that, right? Let's go for three on that. Spiders, fuck it, why not? Yeah, am I supposed to be able to grab these things down at the bottom here? And why do I have a six, a six uh, dice on my head? Add the max possible dice value. Okay, it didn't let me choose one. And what are the coins for as well? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of lost. But it works. It works quite well. And it's playing browser. Okay, it pauses, right? So let's go back to uh, this one. Current funds 258. How do we not have full? Hang on, guys. This is important too, right? Why did it stop? Okay. Yes, we are playing two games at once. Why is it freezing? Oh no, we're stuck. Oh wait, no, we're not. Okay, we're back. Yeah. Increase the speed of this one. I, d I don't get this UI. I haven't a clue what it's about. And I think I might have broken it. Oh, never mind. Ugh.
Yeah, I gotcha. It gets it gets to the point where it's completely impossible, right? Why is it still throwing fucking axes? Damn it, man. Ah, this is what the gold is for. Sure, why not? Oh. Can we die? No. I feel like we can't die then. We can die, okay. It's just very forgiving, thankfully. Increase possible rar rarities. Select an ability out of three. Sure. More fireballs. Do the thing. I like the, the spiders are very unintrusive, so pretty nice. And the uh, the trees and shit are are spawning later as well. A dice game. I don't think I'm familiar with the with the type of game. Ah, there was there was a lot of coins underneath that I was trying to get. But yeah, nice. Incredible. Good job, tanker. But yeah, very, very nice. Um, I like the mechanics. I don't fully understand what was happening in it. We didn't get any quest completed, so I don't think we were playing correctly. So it could definitely use a nice uh, tutorial. Um, even something just in here, honestly, might be good. Um... Just to tell you exactly what, what you were saying there in the chat. Um, other than that, yeah, I wasn't 100% sure about the uh, the UI. I felt like the, um, I felt like it was like, if you roll a one, then you get this. And if you roll a two, then you get that or something like that. But it was all one. So I don't know. I don't know. It was it was a strange one in that in that regard. But overall, great, great stuff, Tom. Um, it was cool. It it held our it held our um, it captivated us for a while there. Now, I I did want to to keep going with it, so it's good stuff. Let's keep going. We're we're still going with this one as well. But yeah, nice one. Good work. Yeah, definitely, definitely uh, a toot. Um, very important. Okay, what's next? We have next Trace Elements by Satolix. Okay, let's get it. Trace Elements. This is another one that play in browser. There's only two tonight that is uh, not play in browser. Okay. Um, game is... Excellent. So I'm surprised to see Satolix in there. I didn't think he was joining. And if you haven't already followed Satolix, I actually have a command. That that bot is probably extremely loud again, is he? Let's bring him down quite a bit. Okay. Run incomplete entry. <laughs> Let's grab some coffee as well while we're at it. That's a big play button. That could well be the biggest play button I've ever seen in my life. 50-50% on that one. Fuck, I forgot that I still had some other stuff there from yesterday's pizza. I could have combined a little bit. Alrighty. Oh. Okay. Okay, we can swing swords. Huh. Yeah. A 
Bit of ragdollin. Oh, <laughs> there's some missing. There's some missing. Uh, what you call it? There's no music on this one, so we can throw our, our own music back on again. Can I raise my sword or my shield? There's a missing uh, animation in there. <laughs> Jeez. Can I hold the button down? No. Ah, it's a fucking click fest. Get over here, you feckers. These guys are confused as to where they're going. Completed way of one somehow. What? Fucking blue ones now. Whoa. Fucking hell. Is it even possible? He did say that he didn't test it, so... <laughs> it may not be possible. This is why we need the journey mode, guys. So even if... Even if you did test it, the chances of me being able to play as well as you guys is slim and none. I'm just gonna... I'm, I'm running away. Is this an infinite runner? Jeez, we're, we're kicking ass now. Completed wave two. I feel like I'm, I'm like leveling up and shit, but it's not really showing me what's going on, you know? Get over here to fuck you feckers. Oh my word, what's going on? I think we might have reached a limit on spawns. Press tab. What? What's the silver one for? I can't, I can't like... I can't bring back my health though, I think I'm just dead. Yeah. Alright, let's try again now that we know that there's a tab button. Right, let's put on the music as well. Jeez, that seems really loud now. How's that? Good? There's quite a bit of clicking involved in this particular game. More like Sato clicks. <laughs> Decent good. Sato actually really <laughs> gotta test this. I don't think it's possible. Fucking just spend it all. Spend it all. It's no possible. It's no possible. Aha, uh -huh, I get it now. I get it. Ask ask the Tolux if there's fucking cheats. I like these guys glowing. Very cool. Fuck off. Fuck off. He's still swinging. <laughs> I can't. I can't. It's cool, yeah. It's cool. <laughs> Jesus. All right. Well, at least he told us. It's um RSI simulator. Yeah, exactly. I never knew about tabs, so I just ran and ran. <laughs> there was a tab menu, yeah. Does it even say it down here? Oh, here we go. Tab, left click, attack. Oh, tap, left click. Tab, up on your upgrade menu. <laughs> this menu is super important. Right. What I want you to do, Satolix, is go into the fucking edit game button. Go to here. Increase this fucking thing by 50 fucking million points of pixelations. Great stuff. All right, we're back again. 
we're back again. We're playing two games at once. They said it was impossible, but it is. <laughs> Great stuff. It tells you to read the instructions, for fuck's sake. It does indeed. Right, what's next? It's good, right, so the assembly required. Um, we should probably go through all the games that we've played so far and take off how we feel about the various rating categories um, at some point. Yeah, it is. It's it's just fun. Yeah, it's a good it's a good one. Um, right, buggy mess is next by Lynx. Love the name Lynx. Definitely awesome. Uh, hey, here we go. <laughs> window mode. Resizable window. Ooh. Nice, okay. Start game. This game is an absolute buggy mess. Love it. Oh, we've got music. It's one of these. Oh, you run like Naruto. You got Naruto running. All right, we're going right. No, we're not. Are we going this way? Oh, we have to press E. Holy shit, the music. Why can't I... Am I supposed to be able to kill these? I feel like I'm definitely supposed to kill these. It's so loud! Thank you, Lynx, for the fucking menu. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, it's the shadows I'm trying to kill. I think there might be a graphical issue. Oh, the doors have opened. Ugh. Oh, bollocks, you die in... Okay, I died in five bits. Bugs patched. Zero. <laughs> All right. Press enter or A to re retry. Okay, A doesn't work. It was a nice thought, but it didn't work. <laughs> you get what's going on? I think so, yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> Did I fall off the edge? What's this? Oh, I can jump! Okay. It's a big jump. You yard your last fecture and oh my word. Oh my word. <laughs> the enemy's lives here. So A to retry it does not work. I love it. I get it now. I get <laughs> Why am I over here, dude? <laughs> oh jeez. Oh my god, it's so difficult. So
only some of them have their shadows off to the side. Is it only one shot to kill these things? Okay, I'm getting the hang of it now. Embrace the bugs. They are part of it. Ah, fuck. Oh my god, this is like the worst bug. Man, I can't do this kind of shit. Where's the journey mode? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. There's too much going on, Lynx. Duh. Just go, just go. It's so difficult. It's controller compatible. I don't think that would matter. You can jump with shift too, okay. Sprite misalignments are on purpose, yeah. I like the concept, yeah, yeah, it's very cool. Alright. Where are that gear games, fella? He's making something like this, but without the bugs. Uh, let's go right this time. Is it random where you go? Boost. <laughs> it's broken. <laughs> oh, what? They won't die. Another bug. Another on purpose bug. Oh, fuck. Lynx, this is a great idea. I need to. Oh, my God. No, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, ah. Ah. How you doing, Pink Gordy? Thank you. You almost saved me with that. It just came in a little bit too late. How you doing, Pink Gordy? Let me crack. Bug reporting. Wait, what? Fuck, it was too fast. Did it did it freeze time when I had that screen open? I can't play games like this, man. They're too difficult for me. Which is a shame because I really <laughs> like it. Uh. 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 Can't kill that one. Okay, this one was locked earlier. <laughs> what the fuck? Ported a bug and got it fixed. Is it getting laggy on purpose now? Because I don't feel the frames drop with the uh, mouse movement and shit. So I'm guessing that's on purpose. I need to go back down, but... Ah, shit. Music is class. What? Do we have to kill all of them? Lag is fake. Incredible. How do I know if I have a key? Do 
don't have to kill all of these, do I? Fully developed, yeah, absolutely. I can see this being really like popular, like doesn't feel like an indie game at all. Reminisce of like you know that you know that game um I wanna be the guy? I'm going through here, fuck this room. Oh jeez. Oh we're back to normal speed. It feels so quick. Ah there's spiders. Oh, I like the way you're a little bit forgiving as well when, when I miss a jump. Huh. How do I... Okay. I need to get more bugs fixed. Should just call this um, development simulator. <laughs> Feels like it. Oh, Lynx is so fucking cool, man. I feel like you've nailed the skill gap kind of learning shit as well. And the platforming is decent. Oh, fuck. Hang on a minute. Ugh. No, oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. It's so difficult. But not too difficult. Fucking class, man. The music is so good as well. I'm guessing that the music is all all you as well, right? What is killing us? Off screen shit? I feel like the hitbox and some of the enemy shots are really good as well. Like one with the broken shit. How you doing, Simon Ott? Yeah, Lynx makes amazing music. Bug report. Oh, shit. Do I need to clear the room first, or will it freeze time? I don't think it froze time last time, right? Thanks. did you make it so that if you die three times, you get infinite life or something? Or am I just gaming out of my mind? You didn't, gotcha. Were you on a team? Is this a team effort or just you? This guy's not dying. Okay, let's fix another bug. Knockback dialed up. Enemies attacks pass through walls. Player's sprite is offset. Player isn't is unable to dash. I don't think I am able to dash. Enemies always detect the player through walls. The rooms don't fully unload sometimes. Okay, yeah, let's do that one. Oh wait, we patched it so that'll never happen again. Okay. Ugh. This one's really forgiven. I like this room. I'm not taking any damage. The no dead thing is an intentional bug. No way. The meta has been changed, <laughs> guys. <laughs> What's the um right? So the sum assembly required is the game is unfinished and you're going around fixing it. Such a nice take on the theme. How do I? How do I finish this level? Is it time based?
Coyote time. The witch. Jump over bullets and enemies. Cool. There we go. Okay. Yes, and that's like a river or something. Maybe it's just, yeah, it's just a... It's a time. Okay. Cool. Fucking deadly, man. Really, really, really cool. This is one of the earlier submissions as well, right? Should just go ham for a few days and get this pumped out. How do you uh, how do you win or finish? Other attacks to to pick up so explore, like in inside this room. I don't think I've ever seen a pickup. Have I have I ran past any of them? Maybe over here. Oof. Cups are hidden. Here? Maybe in there? Oh, fuck. Whoa. That was close. Extra health, okay. Is it gonna fuck up my the bug? <laughs> so now I can die. I love the artwork as well. Oh, it did give me an extra health. Another one. Another bug. Oh, I can dash. Ah, oh, that's so cool. The not being able to die part is kind of cool as well. That's that's like the ultimate journ mode, isn't it? If I leave and come back, will this be the same room? Will it have will it have another console here? I'm trying to cheese it. They don't reset, okay. I wish there was like a timer for how long you had to stay in the room. That'd be cool. These guys aren't aren't killable, right? Is that another intentional bug? Ah, the doors are open. Uh huh. Cool. No, I didn't lose any health. Oh my word. Oh, the dash jump. How do I get in there? Fuck.
Can I knock it in there? Is that the... I can't get in that one. It's a no clip bug. <laughs> Class. Oh, fuck. Whoops. Very forgiving as well with the resets. Really nice. Yeah, yeah. So cool. 10 out of 10 on the idea. Thanks. Come on. Oh, you got to be FPS counter and everything. Very nice. While we're waiting for this to finish. Make sure you have already followed, guys. There's another thing. No, I think I can make that. Yeah. What? Okay. Oh, uh, no. Should have just committed to the jump. Should have just committed. To deal with this thing. What's to deal with this? Is this a boss? Can I kill it? Yeah. A queen bug. Can I kill it or anything? No. Oh, another attack. No. I don't get what this is. Shit. There we go. You can, they just have a lot of health. Is there any point to me going back and killing it? That's cool. 
Okay, I'm gonna leave this room. Ooh. So it seems absolutely massive. How many different rooms and shit is there? <laughs> Faster than me own bullets now. No. No. Ah, oh, my boost is gone. Ah, fuck. Is that like special? I must be special over there, right? Fuck okay, it, we'll go down here instead. How do you win? Like, you have to fix all the bugs? Fix all the bugs, okay. Very cool. I like the not being able to die because I get to see the whole game without, like, you know. Hello, Blint. How you doing, buddy? We're playing two games at once. Oh shit, wrong one. Nice. Oh hey, machine speed. Wait, what the fuck is happening? Wait a minute, is this a bug? Seems like it's a bug. No problem, Belint. Good to see you, buddy. Hope you're well. Did you just find an awesome bug? I think so. Cost money, yeah. But it seems like I was able to, like, remove a shit ton if I did it fast enough. But my sprite wasn't upset, so does that mean I'll never like join a game like that again or a level like that? So it's so cool, Lynx. It's insanely cool. Scroll past an important bug. Sorry. Reading is not my strong suit. Which one was it? The uh, bullets go through walls. Hello, bird. How you doing? Ran a stream for the GSA. Ooh. No way. Bye, nice. How you doing, buddy? Good to see ya. 
Thank you so much for the raid. We're playing through the Jern Jam 2 submissions. You know the, the jam that we participated in last year, but this year. Welcome in everybody. How are you doing? Excel Row, how are you doing? Gotta run, get the kid out. No problem, no problem. See you, in a, see you later, um, finish. How you doing, Jedi Mega Man? Welcome in, everybody. Do, do indeed follow Finite. Guys, if you haven't already, absolutely wonderful being is our Finite. Um, the guy actually that we raided there the other day is using some of Finite's work. Uh, JD. Uh, at the moment, guys, we're playing through some Jern Jam submissions. We hosted a jam there last... Uh, when was it? Ah, oh, yeah, we can't get to that because we don't have the phase through walls, no clip. When it prevents uh, dedicated rooms from containing patches. Aha, uh -huh, gotcha. They normally appear every five rooms, gotcha, okay. It's insanely good, insanely good, links. I am going to leave it there, though. I think we've seen, we've seen a lot of it. Um, brilliant, brilliant idea. Uh, you nailed it. Um, the gameplay, really, really nice, very fluid. And um, yeah, just just fantastic. The the whole concept is brilliant. And like one line said, it would be cool to see this developed out a wee bit more. Um, it wouldn't even need that much, I'd say. It's it seems really complete and really well done so far. Thanks. So great, great uh, stuff. <laughs> Guilt and fuck's sake. You can go back now and try it again. How you doing, Blindfish? <laughs> I loved it. Absolutely loved it. Um, guys, for anybody new coming in uh, with the raid there, my name is John. I usually do game development. We hosted a jam there a couple of weeks ago. Uh, this is my game. Uh, it's been in development for about four years. It's called Rise of Piracy. We recently got a publisher, um, so we can work on it now full time. Um, and uh, yeah, I try and stream every night, 8 o'clock GMT except Sundays. And there you go. <laughs> you did. It took me a wee while to figure out that I had to press E as well. It looks like you should be able to walk through it because it's not blocked off. It's not a door, you know, that you have to action. It's a hole in the wall, so you should be able to just walk through it. But yeah. True, I can remember. It's true. But yeah, welcome in, everybody. Hope you had a good time over there at Finite Stream. And guys, if you haven't already followed the wonderful Finite Singularity, um, make sure you rectify that now. I'm sure you've already gotten to it. Um, yeah, there we go. Sure, there you go. Wish this are appreciated. Uh, we've been working on a side project as well for the last few weeks, and uh, just just for the crack. Um, and uh, we've been having a lot of fun with that as well. I think this is a bug, right? Or is it just that we're earning so much that it's coming back? But yeah, great work, uh, Lynx. That was that was really enjoyable to play through. Uh, last but not least... Oh, wait, is it the last already? Yeah, the last one. Now, we're going to be going into BitGamey's game called The Fun Nest Game. Um, which sounds absolutely class. And this is one that BitGamey actually got to one of the last days and decided, actually, you know what? I want to restart. <laughs> It's fun to watch, excellent. Here we go. Big Kimmy, we're all expecting so much now. Better not be any bugs. <laughs> Good music so far, yeah. I can't uh, I can't full screen it. Is that on purpose? Used to be able to do this back in older versions of Windows, but whatever. Start. Kaka, kaka. Oh, Build that nest. Press space to fly. Okay. Oh. Is it lagging or something? Hang on. Let me kill some other stuff. Um, I think we've pretty much seen this game in its entirety, right? I think we have. Ocular Malice. What do you think? We have enough anyway to rate it. Okay. My computer's garbage, guys, so bear with me as I try and get a few more fucking frames.
You read all the instructions on the page? Of course. All right, space bar. Oh my word. We've got an arrow. We've got eggs. Yeah. Okay. I like the controller. I am an eagle. Floor in it. We definitely have some frames back. Oh. Did I... I grabbed that fella, did I? <laughs> Deadly. <laughs> Fly that eagle too. True. 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 I like the environment. Really, really nice. Yeah. Getting some water. Yeah. Uh... You see, we don't need to read any fucking instructions, Big Amy. Psh, pshaw. Yeah, we've already figured it out. Not even reading your comments, Big Amy. Not even, not even bothered now. Hello, Jay. Built a whole freaking town. True, true, true. Looks so fun. Yeah, it's class. We're building a nest. So the assembly is required to build the nest. Find five more net pieces. I mean, cheaper as feck. Oh. Green. There we go. Rats are red beam. Okay, gotcha. It's fine, Bikami. I can teach you how to play this after if you like. Instructions. Psh. Read, the, read the fucking manual. Psh. Out of here with that shite. <laughs> Another one. Excellent. Yeah, we need more water. Uh. We could just read the DM. Right, it's over there. Oh, fuck. We're a bit... Might make it to this water, don't we? Do I gain speed by dipping down and shit? Bit transparency. I like the beams that you got going on in the sky. Oh, it fully fills you up. Nice. Uh, need more food. I think I fucked up. Um. Um. Nom nom. So we'll probably jump into game development after this one for a couple hours. Let's get at least two hours out of me. Is that another piece? Oh no, it's a rat. Oh. <laughs> it sounded like I just headbutted the ground there, but I didn't. Can you speed up? Soar then dip for faster speed. You're kidding. Oh, deadly. Okay. Forgot to put that in. Would we have learned that if we went into the, um, if we went into the, what you call it? Into the page. Okay. Need one more piece. I'm going to grab water as well. Bitbirdie would have been a good name for this, I think. Bitbirdie, bird simulator. What was the original idea that you gave up on, Bikemi? Them two short keys, keys are not on the page, but you have to the back to you. Yeah, I don't think we need them, Bikemi. Kind of game in here out of my mind, you know. Find the last nest piece. Okay, let's get some food first. Is that it over yonder? I'm not a fan of that sound effect. Ah, oh, there it is. Simple. It sounds windy, but it clearly isn't windy. Rebuild the lighthouse. Cool. And what what happened to that project? 
Do you have any footage or clips of it? How are you doing, Danny? My posture is fine. How about that? Is that better? And game over. What was that? Smug smugness. Was that my face in the background? <laughs> I think it got covered up. Bones crunching was a bit too much. Yeah. <laughs> Great stuff, McKimmy. There was a start, middle, and end. Which isn't what you get in a lot of jam games, let me tell you. Very nice. Good stuff. All right. Like I was saying, let's go back through uh, the the ones that we had and see. All right. So the theme theme was used perfectly there. Fun to play. How it looks. How it sounds. Yeah. All all very good in that one. Innovation, brilliant. Yeah. All of them actually. All of them so far. I think would get. Fairly close to top marks in terms of innovation and theme today. So really, really nice stuff. Oh, we're up to 184 ratings now. Good fucking shit, guys. Keep the ratings coming. All right. And the comments as well. Some nice feedback. There are some that don't have many ratings at all. So just keep it up. Keep it up, all right? And if you're on a team at all, like if you're a participant or a contributor to a project, you should be able to vote. So get in there and do the thing. Due diligence, as they say. Blooper reel. Oh, on Twitter. Pick Amy. Never mind then. <laughs> now, if you want to post any of them, go ahead. A Danny doubloon redeem so I can just empty my balance? What? <laughs> Enjoy face and smoke mess. Sound clip from the vase. Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, really cool. Only a couple of days, right? Two days, three days? Only five left to rate. Nice. Keep it up, guys. I will be checking. It would be a shame for some of you not to reach your full potential haul from the prize pool. Got loads of prizes actually. Even today we got a few more. So very, very cool stuff. Alright, we're going into some game development. Did that work? I feel like that didn't work. Uh what were we doing yesterday? We had a problem. Oh yeah, we got the we got the flashlight fixed up. And we got um Yeah, we got a bug fixed, right? All Gucci. <laughs> I don't know, Sammy. I think the smug one was really good. Weenus. Uh, that could be anything. Sammy, what's the deal with the with the bear thing? <laughs> it's taking a wee while, isn't it? Sorry, yeah, it's not a bear. It's something else. <laughs> Alrighty. Again with the source control shit. Very, very strange that that keeps coming up. Also, this keeps coming up, which is fine, I guess. Right, so, where were we yesterday? I think we left it in a really good spot. Like, everything was working and uh, in multiplayer and all that kind of shit. Everything was Gucci. I still haven't done the FMOD stuff. I haven't the fucking time to do an FMOD um, tutorial at the moment, unfortunately. We removed a lot of his client shit as well. 
So hopefully we don't actually need that. Okay, there is a problem. Number 77. Fucking shit. Fucking shit. Starting to think we start over with this shit, you know. Everything except for the spawn rim, I think, needs, like, huge amounts of work. And we're obviously not going to do that. So... How should we do it? Something something in these is basically wrong, right? So how could we actually figure out what it is? Let me um, see if I can expand on this a little bit. If it gives us the code, we should be able to. Nice one, Big Amy. Great work, buddy. Hunting down a bare 3D model. Couldn't find a good one, so it's decided one of myself. <laughs> Active ragdoll. When it's done, I don't know where it's going. Excellent. Good stuff, buddy. Hmm. Yum. bead equals bear you know what i was just thinking the same thing All right so snap module entry it might actually be possible to modify this code generate module info get bounds Find connection transforms. Let's put in a boodle for this. Now we can see which one it falls over on. Make it after the round doll is so much fun. Oh yeah. Referring to that one video? Yeah, yeah, I'd say so. Where he's getting hit by a fucking taser. Not gonna lie, Sammy, I was kinda like, what the fuck am I looking at the first time I seen it? But I can see the appeal. Ragdolls are so fun. Insanely fun to, to play around with. Oh, these are all off now. Okay, so if I say that, it's not going to do anything. What the fuck? It was a 77 that's broken. Okay. So we can't do that. That's annoying. How else can we figure out um, what's going on with this fucking thing? 
I'm thinking, right, the easiest way to fix this is to re-import the asset, but I don't know what else I've changed. And things like that, Sinti rims, need to not be fucked out of there, you know what I mean? So some of these rims here are fucked for whatever reason. And so number 77 here is not working. So if we go here, 77, build, nothing happens, and then we get that fucking shit. Um, I think we should bring it in and go through each one. We need Jern scripts. Let's just create that real quick. Assets, editor, there is none. One point today, I fucked up on Miss Skillphone, so you got tiny front hands, T Rex bear. Nice. this look like again I can't fucking remember for the life of me open or OP which we need to get back to next week Jern's editor script. I just want to see what it's like, what it looks like. Okay, we need editor window. But what else do we need? Editor window, get window, okay. Close. Public static void and window menu item. It doesn't need any, it doesn't need the menu item thing. Okay, we can just do this. I wanted to see if I remembered it, honestly, so. That's grand. Uh, and then on GUI, uh, we're going to want an if uh, GUI layout button. Let's just copy what we have. Space. Oh. Spacing. Turn spacing utilities. Here we go. Distance between. We can just copy the whole thing, right? I'd love to put this in uh, a repo or something for you guys to grab. Actually, that's just, yeah. Hello, Entropic, how you doing? Good to see ya. Uh, bake the land nav, we don't need that yet. We will need it though, at some point. I think we can just use the base uh, thingy for this. I have such a, like the idea in my head, if I just fucking was able to just get it even 50%, it'll be really, really good. All right, probably. It's just this fucking asset man is giving me so much trouble, every corner. All right, so if we go up here, journal script, spacing utilities, and we space them out uh, 100 each. Whoops. I definitely did not want to do that. Grab these. And uh, space between. Uh, 
Not children, selected. My eyes twitching today. I'm not sure why. Sugar. I'm gonna need more sugar. Maybe it's overheating. Uh, kilted. Maybe. Maybe it's overheating. Would it be? <laughs> maybe that's what it is. It's more than likely, right? Kilted. Finished up the Michael Fitzsimmons document. Excellent. Excellent. B12. Fuck's sake. Dehydrated or too much caffeine? Couldn't be too much caffeine. Speaking of. Let me just make one more coffee. I could be B12 deficient. I had to get injections, you know, about... Oh, jeez, I don't want to think about it. 15 years ago, I had to get fucking injections. My boy. For B12. I wasn't quite as chunky back then, though, so. The spice, my lounge. Uh, it does indeed extend live. Tired eyes and a couple of other things. Oh, stress. Couldn't be tired eyes. Why am I out of tired eyes? Stress. Psh. Stress. Psh. Psh. Couldn't be stress. I don't have any stress. These are fucking yummy, by the way. Sesame sticks. Oh. Spice injections, yeah. Now you're talking. Common cause of vitamin choice is ocular myokemia. Oh, Jesus. Caffeine stress. As a persistent of Oh, my word. It happens to me maybe two, three times a year. Speaking of stress, time to go cook. <laughs> I thought you loved cooking. I'm Birdo. I thought you like really enjoyed it. Usually attribute my eye twitching to trying to repress psychotic. <laughs> ah, yes, of course, my psychotic episodes. I haven't had one of those in a while. <laughs> really must. I really must have a psychotic episode this, this weekend. Maybe on Sunday, it's my day off. Fuck's sake. There was a TV show back in the day called Stressed Eric. Did you ever see Stressed Eric? And he had like a vein in his temple. And it would keep like pulsating during the show. And by the end of it, <laughs> it would burst and strangle himself. <laughs> Thinking back to it, like, I, I remember it so well, but I didn't understand what I was watching at all. Sesame am sticks, yes, exactly. Implied stress eating, oh, right, okay. <laughs> Traffic with the schmug. Do you love cooking? I didn't mean the cooking was stressful. Hmm. I, I feel like sometimes one lion, you hear what you want to hear. And, you know? Making lunch and dinner and then I'm cooked for the house. Nice and tropic and joy. Which one of these is fucked? We've tested the shit out of this one. It's not this one. Why does it have four different scene provider things on it? Maybe that's a problem. Could well be, you know. None of the rest of them have it.
No. No good. Uh, an awful pain in the arse, isn't it? Fucking shite. Of an arse of a bollocks. Oh, uh, what to do, what to do. Where's our spawn zone? Should we get it to a point where we can just fucking play the damn thing? Oh my word, Arctan! Arctan, thank you for the pr for the prime. Nine months, that's a Twitch baby. A prime Twitch baby. Arc... Arc... Jordan Games? Irish Arc Tanning? Maybe? Of an evening? Making lunch and dinner and I'm cook... Oh, oh excellent. Excellent. And traffic. I had lovely pizza today, but I dropped one slice. I let an explicitive out at that point. Maybe that's why my eyes twitch in us. It's proxy delayed pizza slice face down in defense mode. It's coming back to me. Just Arctan is fine. <laughs> Love it. How you doing, Arctan? Thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Appreciate you. Did you see the new emote? We have a new emote. It's the smug emote of an evening. And um, it's been like top, top used emote for like five days in a row or something like that. When, when it first came out, I don't think it was yesterday. Or maybe it was. I didn't check yesterday. Actually, I hope you're well. I'm trying to figure out why... One of these things is fucked. And it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Wait, that's wrong, isn't it? Oh, 100% that's wrong. Four twenty four and a crew quarters all the way over there. Okay, that one's fucked. So maybe that's the problem. Was it lock or key? It was key, right? Oh, it's just... Okay. I fucked up. Let me just grab them again. Working on an old house. Is it a doer upper? That's kind of cool. No? Kind of cool, but a bit fucked, perhaps? Okay. I'm going to re import the dungeon thing. Please don't break. Please don't break everything we've done. Please. I didn't do a commit. A what? A doer upper? Like a... 
old house that you buy for cheaps and then like do it up. So a lot of work involved, but you get it for a nice discount because of the work needed to bring it up to standard. Or is it just like you're just upgrading it and stuff? How you doing, Belint? Belint, how was your meetings today? Have I ever told you that your meetings now are my least favorite time of the day, Belint? Oh, fuck. For spilling my coffee. Hmm. Did you see the games we were playing today? Good crack. Yeah, it's also ready for the weekend, Blint. Especially for Saturday. Might be going airsoft on Saturday. It is not confirmed yet, but it might be. Cannot fucking wait. And we have to do the award ceremony as well for the winners of the jam. For the most part, it's cool. Okay, gotcha. Cool. I'll help to wear Arctan. Get on you. Are you getting any game dev done these days? Hmm. Not a thing. Hateful. Well, fingers crossed, things um, loosen up a wee bit and let you, let you do it. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Downloading it is 50%. Fifty percent of the way there. Are we doing the right thing here? Should we be using this? Or this, perhaps. I was using floor planner and snap before. Maybe we're using the wrong fucking thing. We could use caves and shit as well to make it all voxels. That'd be fun. We'd use all of it. Somebody was talking the other day about mazes as well. <clears throat> and this thing has... Miss Goosey. This thing does have a maze builder. I kind of want to try this one real quick. Uh, let me let me just make sure that the re-import worked. It didn't. It didn't, you fucker. Why? Why didn't it revert these back to what they were? I'm guessing because we have to do this. Yeah, this looks like the right thing. Also didn't, it didn't overwrite the things that it needed. What the fuck is this thing?
Is this the same kind of thing? New game object. Loads of them. Cube red. Okay. Still have Fabricate running? No, I don't think so. I was getting a bit of lag. Interesting. Oh, come on to fuck, man. Okay, here we go. This has got some mad debug shit to it. That's kind of cool. I guess that's red key. That's kind of cool, isn't it? So what is this? Snap grid flow. Snap grid flow. What does it take or how does it grow? Okay, don't care much for learning that. Modules. Number of chunks. Mm-hmm. How does it know where the exits and stuff are? Jeepers fuck. It's got to be here somewhere, right? Snap connection, here we go. <clears throat> uh, test and assets, kinda, yeah. Came back down to answer. Cause the day is like the fancy can with grinned onions, mantry, white cheddar. Ooh, very nice one line, except for the onions. Except for the onions, we don't like them. I don't like my onions of an evening. Did you get my message about FMOD? I did. I'll, I won't lie to Kilted. I have been fucking flat out. Yeah, I need to just do the tutorials. But thank you. 
Yeah, I have had, like, no time to do fucking anything, man. It's been the most ridiculous couple of weeks. I told you half the shit that I've been doing. Level goal. Supported marker. So this spawns something. It's cool, man. It's cool the way it works, but still... <clears throat> Not what I'm looking for. Side scroller prototype, let's see. Oh, it's the little witch thing. Just to get a decent a decent controller for it as well. You get what you pay for when it comes to assets, man. Like this this particular asset is a ridiculous price. But like the amount of stuff you get with it is mind blowing. It really makes me want to trust the um the Unity uh awards. Especially from like I think this was twenty sixteen, one of the assets of the year or something like that. Very, very cool. Right, floor planner. What was the one that we were looking at that might be good? Grid builder, grid builder. Get out of here. Grid builder. Grid flow. Where's grid builder? Fuck yeah. Is this what we were looking at before? It is, man. This isn't what they were showing there, is it? Yeah, this is nowhere close to what we were looking at. No good to us. Hmm. Floor planner. Problem with the grid one here is it's like a it's just not it's not what we're looking for at all. The thing that we had, we had a good thing going, but it was so fucking glitchy, man. Impossible to work on. I don't want to be doing that on a fucking a side project, you know what I mean? Garbage. Yeah, this is no good to us. Yeah, fuck that. Uh, let's have a look at the lunch pad again. Binding of Isaac, isn't that a 2D game? Yeah. Yeah, it's literally just going to be a... Yeah, that's no good to us either. There's definitely something... That we can use for this. Maybe this. Snap grid flow graph. It was snap grid, wasn't it? Module bounds. Module database. Compile module database. Fuck it, go for it. Did nothing. This is kind of what we wanted though, isn't it? So we could take what we have and feed it through something like that and come up with it as well. If 
feel like if we go with this again, maybe we could get this going. Remember we had all of these replaced as well. Oh, there's more. I didn't realize we could we could scroll. Indoor, here we go. Holy fucking shit, there's loads of stuff here. Okay, I have to see this. Holy shit. Okay, very cool, but useless to us anyway. What the fuck is that? So much to this asset, man. Let me see what this one does. Thank you, Danny. That is just mighty, Danny. Mighty. Some of this seems a bit fucked. <laughs> it's just so chaotic. Really good in parts, but then you get that issue. I don't want to put more time into, um, you know, one that won't work again. Too much opportunity there to be broken, it seems. It's cool. But now what we're looking for. Fuck, man. Hard to... 
Hard to come up with something. We could just make a PvP level for now. And then come back to this later. I want to see what this one is. It looks kind of cool. It's a big one. No ceiling. We could put like a generic ceiling across the whole thing. And be done with it. Jeepers, fuck. A treasure chest. It's one thing. Very cool. How's it done? Why this and not an array? Well, there's an array. I'll oh, fuck with this one a little bit. What? I can't? Okay, I can. Okay. Shit ton of overlap. Everything's overlapped by a little bit. And it doesn't work. Let's go back to where we were. Interesting that it has the forward 
the other side as well and every now and again it does these as well and if we squish them <clears throat> they'll end up looking stupid right now what about the ground floor Is this the way to go? Demo sack. Demo a oh, demo Isaac. how simple it can be so what is it that gives it these bounds there it is offset no scale visualize the correct alignment by turning it on from the themes editor toolbar the themes editor toolbar visualize markers okay that does nothing oh it does sorry So if I change this now, now you're talking. That was the main problem we were having before. Positioning, rotation. That's awesome. I think we can use this. Okay, so should we use this or should we use the other one? Also, what about the ceiling? Door, ground, and wall. Thank you for the follow. How, how does it know? You know what I mean? If I add something to this now, how does it know? Oh, emitter door. Marker emitter. It's a rule. Game object node. Marker node. Oh, here we go. Banner, whatever. Marker name, ceiling. What happens now? Does it know that it has to do something with that automatically? It didn't put any of them in. So how does it know not to put that one in? Grid flow minimap. Um, all right, Arctan, take it easy, buddy. Thanks again. Appreciate you. Sorry, guys. I know I'm slow as fuck tonight, but we we wasted a lot of time on the other dungeon generator, and. If that happens again, I will lose interest in the project, I can promise you. How is this a 444? Hmm. How does it know? Like stuff stuff like decoration and stuff like that. How does it know to put it in there? Let's get the other one in here again. Prehistoric. So everything has to be in here because this is the only change. But if we build this fella, 
it now knows to put in direct or decorations and all sorts of crazy shit everywhere. So how does this file know that? The visualizer is fucking deadly. Really cool, especially if you go in here, look. Oh, oh, maybe not. I can barely see it. It's not done with gizmos, it's done with something else. Why wouldn't you just do it with gizmos? Interesting. Let's take that off for a sec. So what is it you're doing here? These names are specified in the spawn items node of the grid flow asset. Grid flow asset. Flow asset. Are you not the grid flow asset? No, you're not. Here you are. Aha. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Sammy, good night, buddy. Thank you, thank you. See you later. I I ain't. I ain't touching this shit. I'll tell you that for free. This is a whole... This is a whole thing to learn. Like... I know about you, but... I ain't learning how to do this shit. <laughs> Where's Anders? Anders, do you know how to use this? Mm. Chemical bonding game. Nah, dude. Not my kind of style. True, Kenny. Kenny, how are you doing? Also, guys, y'all know Munglo. The way, the way Belint just said Munglo there. Belint, are you okay? Still on the IBR clone. Aha, gotcha, gotcha, cool, enjoy. Fuck it, should just make it open fucking source and you can fuck with it all you want then. But there's too many assets that I don't actually, the licensing there would be a balls. Um. <laughs> I don't wanna. Can we like visualize it going through and creating these things? No. Fuck, man. It's crazy, crazy tool. Amazing tool, in fairness. Absolutely amazing. Let's get a PvP thing going, shall we? Ah, fuck. Am I arse now? I need to get the levels back on again. I kind of want to pivot into a flying game, honestly. Or at least have it so that you don't have to always have the same modules. But we, we know that we can get this going. So we could make this Sinti by just fucking with all these values, right? 
but it would be open at the top. Oh, it's very, very spacious now. So we could just shoehorn in our own shit. Oh, wait, what? Okay, scam. Oh, that's the, that's the exit, right? Is this part of it? It is. Okay. It's very cool. Very, very, very cool. Implement your own wave function collapse for simpler dungeons. Wave function collapse. Yes, Kenny. Space cam, that's the one. Brutal game, true. Dude, remember? <laughs> okay, guilted. Uh, all of Zachtronics are awesome. Zachtronic? Space cam. Let me check it out. Alliance Media Holdings. All right, cool. They're a, they're a company. Like, no nah, man, I'm not I'm not clever enough for those kind of games. Maybe this will be good for something after OP. I don't think I have stuff lined up. I think you're. What's the word I'm looking for? Confused. Zachtronics is the guy who made a lot of awesome programming games. Gotcha. Programming games. Okay. That didn't look like programming to me, you know, that last one. <laughs> Looked complicated. Give me, um... Give me fucking Doom or Quake any day, but... No thanks on that other one. Um... All right, back to where we were. The The other one, the snap one, was the way to go. For sure. Whatever has the least... The least stuff to actually do. So why didn't it actually re... We grab all of our stuff. Module one by one. Yeah, so these still have our modifications to them. What's this from? SGF. SGF module. Snap grid flow. Is that what we were just looking at? Because this looks exactly like the other one, but different. Different, but the same. Oh, it's got an upstairs on it. New game objective. The debug view is what's taking a long time. No, it's not. Goal room. Oh, this is much easier. There's no, there's no corridors in this one. It's just all stuck together. What are these? 
enemies. Did it spawn enemies? Hello, Booyah Grandma. How you doing? And Hangerman Hour. Hangerman, I think we have a command for you now. Yeah, there we go. So did Belint just say your name correctly? Hagerman. <laughs> uh, too bad that he stopped doing them because he felt the games are repeating. Gotcha. This one has the, the key stuff as well. Should be a pain in the arse to, um, to make networked. Oh my word. All right, where's the spawn room? Let's use this to fuck. Why not? Let's bring in a uh, type scene DDOL. Good night, Kenny. Take it easy. <laughs> Tuesday. Did you get F mod working? Um, I still have to do my what you call it. Um, jeez, what you call it? The tutorials. I have a few lined up that I still need to uh, work on. All right, let's leave this one here. And bring in, what's this, DG, aha, uh -huh. okay, that's fine, we can get rid of that, or not bring it over. Good tunes. Uh, let's unload this fella and that fella and away we go. First off, where's our modules? Are they here? No. First off, let's do that. It is static already. And let's grab the first... Wait, where are they? Here. Yeah. The spawn room. And now let's not replace it, but overwrite it with the other one that we have already. Make sure that it works. Perfect. Save that, and uh, let's just test it straight away. I think I fooled with it five plus years ago, and then it was the thing to use, yeah. I think it still kinda is, honestly. You see it everywhere. What am I working on right now? I'm just, um, I'm still on the uh, side project. Just chilling. Chilling McMillan. Deadly.
fucking around most of the time, hanging around, honestly. But we've learned a lot with it. I do still have to do the um, the toots on uh, FMAD. But we're getting there. Hopefully tonight or maybe tomorrow I'll get a few of them done. I also have to like consolidate all my fucking music as well. Which is even more annoying. I think I have them actually. I think I have them in all like all the good ones that I went through before. Uh, on one of the um... oh, it works. Nice, perfect. Wait, cannot spawn item chest. Aha! Uh -huh. It's trying to do other shit. Oh my god, some of these are fucking gigantic. How you doing, Tubby? Just see the stuff I got from Tubby's brother yesterday. Very, very cool. Okay, we're not we're not using the actual player content here, but Doesn't have a ceiling either. Kind of annoying. Tony's air style is amazing, yeah. Really, really cool. So we're going with a different thing because that other one kept breaking on me, Tubbs. So here we are again with this one. It's a different type of generating. So hopefully it doesn't have the same pitfalls as the other one. The other one was so strict. Can't pick up anything. But that's okay as well. These uh, these areas are fucking gigantic, though. So hopefully we can pull it down in size. Can't be running for like three hours through the level. Yeah, it's like the scale. The scale is two or three times what they expect. So we can fuck with that a little bit, I think. How you doing, Sanyo? Uh, third of the time I'm messing around too, experimenting. True, 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 true. It's half the fun of it. Did you implement the extra player connection for the automated AI system? No idea what that is. Um, I don't think so. I'm just going to put in the turrets first. Stuff like that. It is a bop, isn't it? We got some really nice music sometimes coming in. Right, I want to see how the f the scale is done. Hold right. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Is this the ending? <laughs> Thank you, Kilton. <laughs> Two. And for snipers indeed, yeah. Okay, so scale. Number of chunks, one by one by one. Module bounds. Chunk size, 40, 40, 40. So can I change this? Wait, it wasn't 40, 40, 40. It was 20, 10, 20. Let's try that. And regenerate. Oh. Oh, wait. It's not good. It's broken it. Could have brought it down in scale. Ah, no, that'd be a pain in the arse as well. Uh, 
SGF demo player. Okay, I'm not sure what that is as well. This is the same thing we were looking at, kind of. Door offset Y. Module DB. Assign the bounds asset that's used by the mo registered module prefabs. So these fellas have a clip on, ah, right, okay. But it seems like the grid itself is confused. Because this is a two by one. Hmm. Okay, I hit the compile button, whatever the fuck that does. No, still overlapping. I put in two or three of these things as well, going up the way. All right, let's reverse the bounds to here. Same as what it was. See how we put on a, oh, it's got an under, underneath. That's kind of cool as well. But it's still absolutely gigantic. Is there a way we can bring down the size of the generated thing? Must be a set in here somewhere for that. I might run to the, hang on. Run to the jacks as well. Right, let me run to the jacks. Be right back. All right. What is that bit, Gamey? What the fuck? Where do you get these emojis? Um, how you doing, Shark? UGC, what's that? Hmm. <laughs> And when you were working on the server connection, you made two connections for the same player, and I was throwing ideas about your automated AI system. Just a thought, though. Gotcha. I think the way we'll do the AI is just raycasts and sphericasts. Overlap sphere would be good for the turrets. The merch blurbs, yeah, they're so good. They are amazing.
right? So these things here are the problem. If we used the door spawn on all of these, every single one of them, where's the, yeah, here we go. Oh man. What is this doing exactly? Is it creating one cube? Ah, oh, there's a bit of overlap. SGF connection. Hang on a minute. Aha, I get it. What about this one? This one has to be outside of it. Cube, my word. Oh, sorry, hang on. It's just the modules, so it's perfect then for what we wanted, actually. Except it doesn't have any um, corridors. But we don't mind that too much. We can just put in our own corridors. Cool, all right, this will do. This will do nicely, as they say. Um, let's just grab a couple of these fellas. Is it just a bunch of the same room, though? It is. But it's putting... More in one than the other. And it's not parenting them either. It's a fucking genius system, man. I need to, like, I need to actually learn how it works, though. I think there's, like, an extra rule in there to go back over everything and spawn a bunch of extra shit. So maybe it isn't actually what we're looking for. But the two by two and one by one and all that kind of crack, if we could replace that with a, what you call it? Oh man, it's a shame we don't have the other graph. But with the same kind of stuff. So the other one had an, an entire extra row Can we get rid of the locks? If we delete these two. I kind of want to do a commit and then try that. Bear with me. Save where it's at at the moment. And this one can be 19, I think. You could scale up the player and all magics, yeah, but then I'd have to go back over the other stuff and scale everything else. So that would actually be more work than scaling down the things that we're about to start using. Yeah, I know what I mean. It's doing a push now, so bear with me if you get any lag. Those games today were fucking deadly. Fucking deadly. And yesterday as well. That one from, uh, what you call him, Captain Coder yesterday was fucking nuts, man. I can't believe how long we spent on it as well. And we beat it on the hardest difficulty, so he came in and actually told us that. So there you go. Beat it on lol difficulty. Not supposed to be possible. Do you know that? Oh my word, Satolix, how you doing? Feckin' Jern Jam indeed. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Casual Alex, how you doing? Sadistic Pillow, how you doing? Deflux. Deflux, thank you for all the bits. Doing wonderful. It was a wild one. Excellent, excellent stuff. Good on you, Satolix. I played your game at some point. When was it? 
And uh, let me give a timeout to the bots. Game jams, treating it great, great. Love them, absolutely love them. <laughs> yeah, I, I enjoyed it. It was cool. Yeah, it was a lot of um, it was a lot of clicking. It was an RSI simulator, <laughs> but no, it was good. Yeah, very very cool. It was a great start to something. Anyway, it has it definitely has a lot of potential. But yeah, it was a good crack. But yeah, how was your how was your stream? What were you up to? If you have anything at all you wanna you wanna share with us at all, throw it in the chat. The glowing characters, that's the one, yeah. And the hack and slashy kind of stuff going on. There we go. The commit is done. I should probably delete all the stuff I'm not using because that was a huge commit. Thank you for the follow. Skipped a couple of days, that hurt. Yeah, I'd say so. Two weeks isn't much time, like. Until you see my end, if you think it had a lot of clicking, oh, you're kidding me. I'm going to have to download an auto-clicker, am I? To find just some art. Excellent. So our uh, sadistic pillow. Good stuff. I'm doing well. Thank you. Working on the old chatbot. Huge refactor I've been doing for the last few weeks. Nice. Nice. Good stuff. If you have anything at all you want to share with us, at Tolix, throw it in the chat. Thank you very, very much again for the... Um For the, uh, hang on, why isn't the wish list? Ah, there we go. Sorry, Adam timed out. Uh, but yeah, do throw it in the chat. For anybody new coming in, my name is John. I work on a game called Rise of Piracy, usually. Uh, we should be back to this on, well, technically on Sunday, but uh, back, back again on Monday. Um, I've been working on it for about four years. It's um, kind of plays a lot like Mountain Blade, but with pirate ships. Um, I recently got a publisher as well this year that uh, allows me to work on it full time. Um, I try and stream every night, 8 o'clock GMT, except Sundays. And um, yeah, most recently we've been doing the Jern Jam stuff. So I was playing a lot of your games today and yesterday. Um, some absolute gems in there. It's been fucking nuts. Some of them are... Cheaper as fuck, like, can't believe they're from the jam, you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, it's going really well. We've been working on a side project as well during the during the jam. And uh, we're going to be playing more games tomorrow and the day after. And we'll either have the award ceremony and the winner announcements and all that kind of crack either on Friday or on Saturday. All right. I don't know if the is the audio all right, guys, because it's like we had to fuck with it for the for the games. I hope it's all right. Um, the day's been going well. Yeah, we were just looking at this. Um, we have an asset, you see, that I've been itching to use for fucking years since I got it. Honestly, it's like a two hundred dollar asset, and uh, it's for generating dungeons and doing like um, procedural generation and stuff with that, like that. So we were looking at all the different features of it, and uh, we've made a game. Uh, and I can just I can just boot up what we just built to show you. And the idea was I wanted to refresh my memory on on a lot of mirror stuff. So I actually made a server, an EC2 micro, which ended up being a, a medium. And uh, um, yeah, so it's all about like you can jump into a game with with other people, and then you can jump into other uh, scenes. And uh, the scenes that they jump into are, well, there's this transition scene. And then the next one that they get to is going to be um, a, oh, that didn't work this time. Oh, no, it did work, but one of them is fecked. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, there's a bit of lag in the generation of these ones for whatever reason. Um, and then you spawn in and uh, this level is procedurally generated. And, uh, yeah, can run around and do whatever the fuck we want with it. So it was going to be just a, a shooter um, PvP stuff. I had planned to put it into WebGL build and to have that as the, um, like, a, an IBR, but a third-person um, shooter uh, with, like, a bunch of different weapons and... Um, you can run around and kill each other and we'd have like a, an overlay on the stream then to show what's going on maybe using um like i had a, I had an idea to put in a, a camera and uh make it render like um like a radar kind of thing 
And uh, if we wanted to, then we could press a button that would change it from a, a render texture into an actual orthographic camera. So we can like check out each piece and zoom in on various spots and that kind of shit. I think that would be good crack. But um, yeah, we're not sure yet. Uh, I failed with the WebGL stuff. I reverted a lot of changes there. But um, yeah, that's where we're at at the moment. There you go. But yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Um, I brought in uh, FMOD a few days ago. I have to do a few, what you call it, um, uh, tutorials on that before we can start working with it. Gather my sounds and stuff like that as well because there's some upcoming work in Rise of Piracy that needs it. So there you go. Um, but yeah, good stuff that you're working back on the bot again. Very, very cool. WebGL. WebGL itself is fine, right? But... WebGL using Mirror is a bastard because you need a reverse proxy. And it's not just any reverse proxy. It needs like um, URL rewriting and all of this other web um, web dev crap that I've been trying my whole life to get away from. You know what I mean? So I um, was messing around with like um, web configs and all sorts of stupid fucking boring garbage that i can't i can't fucking stand so i just i got it very very close right i got it to the point where i could hit the server with um a web version of this but not through itch and that was fucking pissing me off and i couldn't be arsed and there was like certificates and fucking all of these different programs and fucking stupid commands that I had to run. It was just, I'm not in the mood for that kind of shit. Freshy, good to see you. How you keeping? Yeah, exactly, Deflux. Fuck all of that shit. <laughs> so yeah, we're back to the game dev now, which is funner. And uh, we're just using KCP as the transport. No more web socket shit. Fuck that. Fuck that. <laughs> J-Dog, thank you. Appreciate all the follows. Uh, like I said, I try and stream every night until um for at least two to four hours and uh it's always at eight o'clock gmt and that's this is as far as we well we we had gotten further but the other version of what we were doing was a bit fecked i wanted to kind of try and guess um more like one v one by ones and shit like that in there but i don't actually know how that's how that's done actually let's try and let's try and dupe this and go one by one uh, S. And let's see if we can actually add that into the grid. Such a cool asset though. Jesus, amazing. Module DB. Here we go. Element six. Uh, this one. And this one will be a what? A room? Selection weight one. One by one is at the top here. Let's give it a three. Actually, let's give it a two and then color it in or something. Uh, there we go. Bat material. See if we get any bat material ones when we build it now. Doesn't look like... Oh, there we go. No. No. Oh, it is that one. Okay. Why does it have two... Con that was green a second ago, wasn't it? Or purple or something, right? I don't know. It's driving me fucking nuts. All right. How you doing, JD? Good to see you. The toughest part of working on jam games is deciding whether... To... Yeah, yeah, true. Satolix, true. I think Seisha should put the game jam on Steam. Yeah, go for it. The Windows Store, why not? Fuck it up, yeah, buddy. You should jump in with him, Deep Flux. You might, you might enjoy it. You never know. <laughs> Thanks a million, Satolix, for the, for the raid again, buddy. Okay, so we can like we can add as many modules as we want to this thing then. So we might even um remove the one by two. And the fact that it was weight three there 
seem to be a wee bit mad. Do we have a... No, we don't have a... Our seed button doesn't have the little randomize button next to it. I can't remember where we've seen that, actually. Num graph retries. Maybe that's what it's doing. It's like calculating all the different levels. Ah, oh, that's cool as fuck. So we get a three layer, whatchamacallit, from this stuff. Uh, let me just try and remove one real quick. Uh, let's give that a one and not a five. Probably means that it, it doesn't want the high weight one, surely. Surely not. Good stuff, JD. Enjoy it. Jeez, I put one everywhere there. So the weight must be... Chance of it actually generating or not. My word, I put loads in. There's no way in here. It messed up. That should be gone. I wonder if that's because of what we did. Let me try that again. So this is with a one instead of a five. Why does this one take so long over the other one? It must be this num graph retries shite. Cannot build retries exhausted. Try adjusting your flow graph, increasing the number of retries parameter. So it tried to resolve that one th one hundred times and failed. Ah, oh, can't really be arsed, honestly. Fucking with this. If we got rid of these, this is what we were gonna do earlier, wasn't it? What if we just skip ahead? We don't need these, right? We'll do them ourselves. All path one. Cannot merge back. What does that mean though? How about that? Build. Yeah, whatever. Nice, okay. That's so quick as well. So it was something got to do with the um with the keys. It didn't do doors though. Why didn't it do the doors? It did this one. The rest of them are all fucked. And you can't undo these. Good thing we did a, what you call it, a check-in. Thanks, Artex. Take it easy, buddy. See you later. Guys, we are actually wrapping up now anyway. Actually, I'll do this off stream. I was finishing up um, before 12. So let's find somebody to raid. And thank you all very, very, very much for hanging out. Uh, let's see who's about. We're spoiled for choice today. Jeepers, everybody's on. What the fuck? What is it today, Tuesday? Um, tomorrow we're going to be playing um, another five games tomorrow. Let's raid out to L, Cool, and Q and we can go through them. 
Thanks a million, Satolix, again for the raid there. Thanks a million for hanging out, everybody. Uh, tomorrow we will be playing. Where's our schedule? Thursday. No, Wednesday. So Wednesday is Battleforge, Clockwork Life, Petrol, Churn Jam 2, Drop Ball, and Resemble. Excellent stuff. So that's um, Brian, Canny, Melza Manadano, Danny, Danny, Sammy, and Pabs are all in there. So regulars. A regulars day tomorrow. Fan-fucking-tastic. Good stuff. Thindle, thank you so much. Thanks, guys, so much for hanging out. I shall see you all tomorrow. Cheaper's 55. Fuck's sake. We're doing this shite. <laughs> Must be just from the from the raid, mostly, I'd say. Um, but yeah, thanks a million, guys. Appreciate you all. If you haven't already checked out my actual project, it's called Rise of Piracy. You can wish us it there. Check it out. Everything you'd ever want to know about the game is is there on the um, on the Steam page. And um, thanks for all the follows as well, and all the subs and biddies and all of that kind of crack. Um, good crack. Love the games today. Very very cool. And um, the VOD will be up immediately after the stream stops. So if you want to check it out, it was the first half of the stream there. And thanks a million again. Thank you so, so much. See y'all uh, tomorrow. Bye-bye.